Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. In this video, I'm not 100% sure if this is a good thing or a bad thing or if it'll work, but I think it'll work. Somebody contacted me and wanted to know if they could print off some of the Corel or all the Corel colors so they could print them off in, on a piece of paper. They're sublimation people, you know, cups or t-shirts or something. And they'd want to see what the colors look like to show the customers. And, you know, I don't know, you know, if you print it off on paper and you're going to print it off on, I guess it would work because this kind of works. So to get the, and it'd be nice to know that this is red 255, but you've got red, magenta, purple, and you can kind of read it. Now I had to copy this in there. So they're a little bit fuzzy. But if you look, the colors are true. And if you look at these two side by side, you can't tell the difference in the colors. Now, this one's a little sharper than that one. And just to kind of prove the point, we can get our attribute docker or our attribute eyedropper and actually take the color. And let's look at orange is 255, 102. We'll go down here. 255 102 so it's reading the color correctly so how i got to this everybody that has windows has a tool inside of windows called a snippet so what you do you go to tools or go to windows color palettes no take it back you don't have to go there all you have to do is click on this arrow right here show names of the colors okay we're going to go down there and get some more because we we're down to ice blue so you just have to go down to the next colors and this isn't exactly what he was wanting to do and i've actually contacted my buddy at corral to see if there's a better way to do this and then just get your snipping tool X out of that one because I've already done it. Go to the snipping tool, which is inside a window, and put new. And grab this color. And then go up to edit, copy, paste, and then make it the same size as your other ones. So they'd be relatively close. And let's just prove that it works. There is turquoise. Get our eyedropper tool for color. Our turquoise is 102, 255, 204. 102, 255, 204. So it's reading the color correctly. Now, if you print this out, this might not be as sharp as you like. But you'd definitely be able to tell that that's the green grass or Kentucky green or light green or pink or orange. So if I find another way, I will make a second video and probably delete this one. But that's the only way I know how to do it right now. I hope that helped them a little bit. Thank you for watching.